What up guys, back at y'all with another video. I'm gonna be hitting some thrifts, but I'm gonna be hitting some thrifts in San Antonio, Texas. So we're on our way right now, me and Brian. We've been hitting a lot of thrifts in Houston and Austin. We've been thrifting hard, um, but I haven't actually been bringing my camera. So I'm gonna take my camera along with you because I've been finding a lot of great stuff. So I'm gonna show you guys um, and hopefully San Antonio holds me down when I go down there. It's only about an hour away, so we should be down there pretty soon and then see what we can find, guys. I'm at Texas Thrift right now. It's freaking huge. I've never been to this one. So hopefully they got some flame for us. Um, and let's get into it, guys. All right, we got that Coogee flame. Coogee, and then you got that Biggie sweater in the middle. Coogee 598, they kind of tax on it, but still pretty cool fun. Got this Chaps by Ralph Lauren striped tee. I mean, striped button up for 698. Got that old school Chaps by Ralph Lauren tag in there. No tags on the outside, but they're kind of staining. Like I said, they want $7, size large. All right, Brian, with the first dope find, we got this Dallas Cowboys um, all screen printed nutmeg for only $3.98. Got the patch on the bottom. What size is it? It is an XL, so really clean find. Not really much cracking or anything going on, so definitely gonna grab this. All right, out of Texas Thrift with some goodies. Brian got some goodies. Luckily on Thursdays, it's 30% off. We had no idea it was 30% off. The lady just told us. And he happened to have a student ID from when he was in high school, and they hooked it up for both of us. So we got it for the low low. On to the next thrift store. Um, I think it's gonna be a Goodwill, which is down. All right, next stop is this Goodwill. It looks like a pretty big Goodwill. We're working our way into the city of San Antonio. So this is the next stop, so we're gonna check it out. Let's see what they got. All right, a couple of good things with this uh, Goodwill. Usually Goodwill's let me down, but got this Grave Digger tee for $2.99. Gonna go ahead and grab that. Graphics on that are pretty clean. You got this Mickey Mouse um, vintage t-shirt with all the flags around it. It's pretty cool, but I think I'm gonna pass on it. They want only $2.99, but I think I'm gonna pass on this one. And then the grail font at this store is this Texas A&M. Um, get used, it says get used to it. And then it's by Red Oak. Pretty cool. They only want $2.99 to size extra large, but the graphics are pretty cool. All right, in the process of leaving Goodwill, we checked the little display case and they had this fire Tommy Hill figure with the H and the flag in the middle for $7.99, but it was actually 50% off today. I don't know why. What was it 50% off for? Pink tag. To what? Oh, pink tag. I guess pink tag with 50% off. So we just got lucky and got it for $4. All right, we're at the Family Thrift Center. Usually they have some pretty good stuff. I've been to the ones in uh, Houston. This is the first time the one in San Antonio. They usually have some good deals. Thursday, they have everything for two dollars. So everything's two dollars in here. Let's go check it out, guys. All right. So in the mix of all this, we found this Nautica jeans, Nautica jeans um, embroidered right there. That two-tone blue, red with the white stripe in the middle. Nautica jeans tag right here. It's a size XL for two bucks. Gonna go ahead and grab that. We got this uh, pretty dope screen printed 2000 St. Louis Rams champs. Uh, you can see like the ring on this. The detail is super crazy on there. It is also a pro player for two dollars. Gonna go ahead and grab this also. All right, got a little bit of momentum going in here. We got this 1992 St. Louis Cardinals um, screen printed on here. Got a little bit of cracking on there. Nothing bad though. It is I don't know what brand this is. Garn? I don't know. Garn is the brand. But it's really, really clean. Like I said, $2 today. Gonna go ahead and pick this bad boy up. We got this old school fat farm and that cursive lettering. Don't know how old exactly it is. Looks kind of old, but super clean. $2. Gonna go ahead and pass on it because I got a little bit of stains all over it. But uh, still a cool thing. Ah, uh, shit. Some Logo Athletic. Got that Dallas Cowboys National Football League. Really simple, though. I don't know if I want to pay $2 for it. Not much going on. That's all that's going on the front, back, baiting. All right, we got this nice button up in this navy blue color. We got Pooh Bear and Tigger, the honey on the on the pocket right here. Really nice for two bucks. Think I'm gonna go ahead and grab this. Brian found this pretty crazy American flag button up. We got the stars over here and the stripes going all the way down. It's pretty crazy, pretty cool. All right, got that vintage Tommy jeans size medium stripes going all the way down it, and then you got that vintage. Tommy Hilfiger logo on the sleeve. Pretty clean. I'm gonna go ahead and cop this for two bucks. Alright, shout out to Brian once again coming through with the dope fonts. We got this dope Wrangler uh, button up. Wrangler going all the way down the buttons. Two tone. That Wrangler on the arm. Pretty clean Wrangler t shirt. Very Western looking for two dollars. Gonna go ahead and cop that. 
got that Texas A&M Lee Sport um, crew neck. Pretty cool, but I'm gonna go ahead and pass on it just because it's super plain, nothing going on with it. Jumping right out of Family Thrift Center with a bag full of goodies. Like I said, everything was $2, so I paid $12 for everything in this bag. I'm gonna hit one more Family Thrift Center in, um, in San Antonio, and then I'm gonna head to Austin or get something to eat, I don't know. Um, I'm trying to beat traffic, so depending on how that is, I'm gonna decide what I wanna do. But then at the very end of this video, I'm gonna show you everything that I picked up um, from San Antonio. All right, last Family Thrift Center hold us down the last one held us down we found some flame in there so we're about to go on this one today's two dollar thursdays let's get it got that nautica flame in here brian found but it is a 3x so too big for me to cop oh and then coming off the shelf we got that cadillac pinstripe what's on the back i don't know what that is but that's pretty clean all right going through the jerseys i found this fire lsu starter jersey for two dollars it says 4.94 but it's an outlet so it's a starter let me show you the starter patch on the tag got the starter patch on the bottom and then lsu on the back which is super clean and lsu tigers on the arm sleeve super clean all right we got this fire dale earnhardt graphic tee in a size 2x i think clear for takeoff another shot of it right here it's just really clean i'm gonna go ahead and pick this up for two dollars ryan found a carmelo anthony denver nuggets jersey hardwood classics. hardwood classics pretty clean then we got this country singer uh tour t-shirt diamond the screen print is crazy and then on the back you got love a little stronger and that says diamond rio tour from 1994 so for being 1994 it looks brand new Alright, leaving Family Thrift Center with a bag full of goodies. Found some decent stuff today, so I'm going to show you guys at the end of this video right now when I get home of everything that I found. Uh, found some pretty good stuff in here in San Antonio about to beat traffic and drive back. So I'm going to get something to eat right now and then show you guys everything I picked up in today's Trip to the Thrift SA Edition. Alright guys, back at my house. I'm going to show you everything I picked up from San Antonio. This stuff is not in any order. i just kind of going to show you guys... Um, Everything I picked up, so let's go ahead and get into it. I got this Diamond Rio um, screen print t-shirt from 1994. It's a country band, um, country singer, country brand. I'm not exactly sure. Don't roast me on it, guys. I just like the graphics that were on it, and it was look really cool. And then across the back, uh, let me show you the back also. I showed you a little bit in the thrift store, but you got it across the back. Diamond Rio, and then it says Love is a Little Stronger Tour, and then at the very bottom, 1994. Just the, the graphics on it were really clean, so I went ahead and picked this up for $2 at Family Thrift Center. Um, this was also picked up at Family Thrift Center. It's a LSU starter jersey, which was really cool. I've never seen one like this before. It's like a really light purple, and then you got the starter patch on the bottom, um, and then you got the tiger patch right here on the right side and then the patch of starter on the left side and then you got the starter on the tag um got this at family thrift center for two dollars also um and then you got the lsu on the uh on the left side sleeve and then lsu across the back with the patch 14 so this is a really good condition starter jersey um for lsu so i went ahead and picked that up for two dollars also at family thrift center got this dell on heart number three um nothing too crazy about this most of the time i like to get more loud screen printed t-shirts especially when it comes to nascar but i couldn't pass this up for two dollars dell on heart number three and then on the back you got the uh same thing pretty much just the basically the back of the car so nothing too crazy about the back of it either just had to pick that one up for two dollars couldn't let that pass then we found this wrangler this vintage wrangler t-shirt you got the stripes going down something i really liked about this was that it had the wrangler going all the way down so like little details like that really stand out this is really nice how they did that got the wrangler patch on the inside and then on the sleeve you got a wrangler patch going on the sleeve also which was a really nice um detail on it but yeah i went ahead and picked that up also on to the next thing got this st louis rams uh screen printed t-shirt from pro player um i actually haven't found too much pro player um gear in the past so this is pretty cool that i found this pro player st louis rams from super bowl and uh this is in 2000 so the year is 2000 so really good condition no cracking no nothing pick this up for two bucks also at family thrift center on to the next thing we got this tommy hill figure or tommy jeans um button up 
and you got Tommy Hill figure on the arm, which was really nice. And then just a simple button up, nothing too crazy. Got this for $2 at Family Thrift Center. Also, got this Nautica jeans. I really like how they uh, stitched that in right here, this Nautica jeans. And then you got the white stripe, red, blue, just like the United States flag. And then you got the Nautica tag right there. So this was really nice pickup. Went ahead and picked that up. Also, then you got this um, St. Louis Cardinals 1992 t-shirt really clean it's really not too much going on it was just really good condition t-shirt and i got it for a good deal so i couldn't pass it up the brand is garn i'm not sure um garn i don't think i've ever picked anything up from that brand but like i said it's from 1992 really cool not much cracking so i went ahead and picked that up also was a nice little pickup next thing i got was this grave digger i know it's not I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure this is not vintage. Just by looking at it, it doesn't look very vintage. But the Gravedigger um, print on there was really nice. So I went ahead and picked this up. It didn't have a tag on there. The tag was ripped off. So I'm not exactly sure what size it is. It looks like a small. So I'm thinking it's going to be a small. But it was just a really nice shirt. So I went ahead and picked it up. And then we got uh, from Goodwill. Got this Texas A&M um, Wins. Get used to it. By Red Oak. Very vintage t-shirt. Um, here goes the red oak tag size. Uh, what is it? Extra large. Yeah, it's so extra large. Just a really nice design. So I went ahead and picked that up from Goodwill. Usually Goodwill is kind of weak, but uh, they had this pretty cool t-shirt, so it wasn't too bad. And then the last thing was this. Uh, we picked this up from Texas Thrift. was the Dallas Cowboys Nutmeg t-shirt. Um, this was a really good really good condition t-shirt as you can see it says nutmeg size xl and then it got the huge patch on the bottom team nfl nutmeg so this is a really nice t-shirt so i went ahead and picked this up there's no cracking going on at all so this is a really good pickup but yeah guys that was pretty much it as far as all the pickups goes let me know what you guys think i'll definitely be dropping more videos soon um sorry for the wait guys on videos i've just been really busy um i have a lot of things going on right now so but i've definitely been doing a lot of thrifting lately and i uh, got a smaller camera to take take you guys along for the ride so if you like anything in this video Make sure to follow me on Instagram. Hit me up if you like anything, guys. I'm out. Peace.